was the night before Christmas, and there in the town all the people were finding a place to lay down. There were Shirley's and George's and Jane's and Jackson's all coming back to sign up to pay taxes. And there in the crowd, whom should we see but Mary and Joseph trying hard as could be to find a safe place to join the shed because her baby was coming. She needed a bed. Joseph knocked on the doors, but there just was no room, and they needed a place, and they needed it soon. So they found a dry room where folks keep their cows and their donkeys and horses. Not much of a house, but at least it was dry. It was safe. It was warm. It would be good enough when the baby was born. And the night became Christmas. A small baby's cry broke the quiet and still of the night passing by. Just one little child, a new little life, would bring hope and freedom from all pain and strife, for this child was special. God's only son, bringing God's love and God's hope and joy for each one. Because he was born, God's love came so near to be stronger than sin, stronger than fear, strong enough to bring gladness to each person's face, strong enough, yes, to welcome the whole human race. And outside the window there rose such a clatter, Joseph sprang up to see just what was the matter. And there outside standing were shepherds and sheep. They came by because angels had broken their sleep, saying, God's Son is born, the Savior named Jesus, and peace to the world and whomever God pleases. They gathered their sheep and started their looking. They wanted to find out just what God was cooking. I wish we were there. In that spare cattle stall, we could watch baby Jesus from our place by the wall. Of course he was cute. Of course he was small. Yet still big enough to bring God to us all. We do see him go when we pray and we sing and remember the love that our Lord came to bring the hungry get food, the thirsty get drink. The bright love of Jesus shines more than we think. It shines when we help. It shines when we love. It shines when we share God's joy from above. We are there with the shepherds when we can adore and pray for Christ's love to grow more and more. This world is still dark and heartless and cold, still covered with violence and suffering untold. But this child means peace, and this child means joy, and a love that not even death can destroy. So we carry that love where people are hurting, so we bring that light where darkness lay lurking. So we bring that hope wheresoever it flows, just as surely as Christmas brings God's love so close. And now we give thanks. Let our joy overflow and worship like shepherds did so long ago. And we sing with them now, ere they walk out of sight. Merry Christmas to all on this holy night. Amen.